Hi lovely viewers, it's me again your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Choir, thank you. Thank you, choir. For those that are watching us live on social media, you can go to the pages, but just mute for his pictures. I'll invite His Excellency, Zambia's sixth president, who's also Patrioti Front president, to give his remarks. May I have your silence? May I have your silence? Jashmeni Kwama Tui. His Excellency, President. On 28th October 2023, I, Edgar Chagwalungu, the 60th President of the Republic of Zambia, did officially announce my comeback into active politics. Uh, this was during the ninth memorial ceremony of President Michael Chirufiasata, the founder of the Patriotic Front. On that day, I mentioned that I came back into active politics to defend constitutional democracy, rule of law, as well as help unite the opposition to foster effective checks and balances and present a united front in the 2026 general elections. Today, I want to repeat myself and emphasize my call for all opposition parties, civil society organizations, and progressive citizens to come together and fight to rescue our country and restore constitutionalism, democracy, and rule of law. I have repeatedly expressed willingness to work with members of the opposition and other progressive social formations to save our country from the current ruinous path. We should not encourage working in isolation and in boxes, but forge alliances driven by a unit of purpose in order to develop our country. The church, civil society, trade unions, academia, and political parties must collaborate and identify common issues that must be promoted together to rescue our people and the country from the failures, mismanagement, and misrule perpetuated by this incompetent government. Yes, it's no longer a secret that the UPND has plunged the country into economic turmoil, engaged in bad governance, destroyed the constitutionalism, oppressed the citizens, and lamentably failed to deliver public services and campaign promises. Make no mistake, this fight is not merely about removing the UPND from government, it is about restoring the well-being of the Zambian people. We must recognize that our country is suffering from an economic meltdown, high cost of living, unprecedented load shedding, and other crises. The fight is about that bus driver who had hoped for better income by reason of the promise of cheaper fuel, but is now disappointed that the promises have not been fulfilled. It's about that Baba uh, in Mtendere, that hairdresser in Chuempala, that welder in Mazabuka, who hoped that Lord Shedding was behind us, considering that we, in the Patriotic Front, PF, ended Lord Shedding. But now, such businesses are shutting down or going for several days without electricity in their workplaces. 
is about that market here. We are struggling to make ends meet because of the hostile business environment. It is about that street vendor who is hustling and him income of hand to mouth, but now cannot even afford to find a market or place to trade from. It is about restoring an effective farmer input support program that delivers input at the farm gate and ensures that the small holder farmer is food secure. Ladies and gentlemen, fellow countrymen and women, the youth, and all our children, I am thankful and honored for this noble gesture by the two say, Alliance partners of adopting me as the 2026 presidential candidate. I pledge that I will not let you down as your 2026 candidate. With your support and the support of the collective Zambians, be assured that victory is certain. My appeal to other political alliances, such as the United Quarter Alliance, UCA, People's Pact, the Zambia We Want, and other political parties, is that let's keep our doors wide open to talk together, to work together, to redeem this country, especially that all political and economic parameters are clearly, clearly showing that this government and its leaders will not save Zambia. I thank you and may the Almighty God bless our country, Zambia. All right, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you. Peace. I gotta go.